Okay, for this video, we're going to show you how to make a catacombs key and do the uh, ancient catacombs. I've got one key there, but I'll make another just to show you. Go over to your map stones here. Click on the key to the ancient catacombs right here. And as you can see, right now it costs 50 of each map stone which are these here. Um, it changes from season to season depending on what they're doing and everything else. So it may be a different, uh, like last season it was 20, 20 each. So just bear that in mind. It may change from uh, this season to next. Okay, so you just hit craft. Now we have two of them. So you come over to your doorway here. Put one in. And you activate. Now this dungeon only has some slugs in it, and that's it. All the rest is just loot. So you don't have to be worried about what level to be to do it or anything like that. You just have to be have a high enough uh, rupture completed in order to go in there. It'll also uh, make the rupture uh, 50. As you can see, mine's level 176. It's 50 more than the highest rupture level you completed. Now, if you've got a wide uh, pickup zone or pickup uh, range in here, so just uh, remember that going through. As you can see, it picks up all the uh, stuff here from a fairly good distance. So you just want to do that and kill the slugs. And there's three secret rooms which I will show that uh, give you different things. And when we get to them, I'll show you. So on to the next portion here. I just run straight up the middle and then down each side. And you should have picked up all the uh, gems in that. As you can see, different slugs give you different things. These are all large slugs, so those ones there give you large gemstones. You also get uh, dwarven dwarven runes as well during here. All right, so down this alley. Here's your first secret room. Break the break the door. And here you'll see your ring recipes are for each and every one of them. There's six in total because there's six classes. There should be one more little toadstool here, but I've already uh, got my two hand one. I only pick up the one that uh, of the stance I'm going to be using because if you pick all six up, you may craft the wrong one by mistake or something. I've done that before. That's why I only take the one I actually am going to use. So you basically just go through. I usually kill the uh, slugs first. Okay, so we're in the final room here, and there are two uh, two more secret rooms in here. Here's the first one, as you can see, the door 
there you got to break it so you break through and this chest will give you an imbued dwarven room and <coughs> there you have it there so we go on keep picking up stuff get stance stones as well scroll on here as you can see there's little cubby holes here you got to stay fairly close to the wall to get them all and here's the final secret room right here come in here and right here this chest gives you your uh, your kata two uh, fragments so that you can make a kata two dungeon and as you can see I now have four go back and finish this dungeon and basically that's it if you don't want the uh, update on to show on your uh, on here where's catacombs right there then you just portal out but if you do want to want to show it all you do is click on the portal and that's it for that catacombs that's the end of this uh, video